Hello, this is Vane. This is another video about miniature dolls. This is a miniature uh, Glamour Gal doll made by the company Kenner in 1980-1981. Uh, She's wearing an original dress that was made in the same time period uh, by the same company. And she has painted shoes and she has a peach colored dress and I made her this little itty bitty bracelet and um, she's like a little miniature Barbie but this video is not about this doll in particular I'm going to use my doll uh, to compare her to the doll that is supposed to be the highlight of this video what I have here is a 1971 Mattel doll uh, by the brand, uh, with the brand called Fashion Teeners. That was the name of the the doll line at that time. Uh, there were four dolls in all. This one in particular, her name is Doreen. Uh, she was one of two blondes made in 1971, and um, she's really rare. They didn't make a lot of these type of dolls. When I got her, um, I got her at um, eBay, and the user did not actually put a lot of details on her. Uh, in fact, they just put mini dolls, and, and I was searching under mini dolls, and I got this doll for um, $34, which is a bargain. Uh, this doll is really worth more than $34. She's wearing a pink uh, top. It's sort of scrunched up together because she's wearing her jacket over it. It's supposed to be like a v-neck, but it's all squished together because of the jacket she's wearing. This is her original jacket with a little faux fur, and she is wearing, um, like, her slacks, and those are all original to her. Um, this doll... She's supposed to come with a pink bathing suit, like a little plastic bathing suit with like snaps to close the bathing suit on her. I only have the bottoms, but I don't have the top of the bathing suit. And I'm also missing uh, one shoe and uh, a skirt. But other than that, uh, I have most of the clothing of the doll and the doll. As you can see, she's in mint condition. This doll, in particular, her hair was glued onto her little scalp, um, and then there was some stitching on the on the part of her hair in the middle. She is four inches tall, and she's just slightly shorter than my Glamour Gal doll that is four and a half inches tall. She's, yeah, you could tell right there that she's slightly shorter, and uh, um. This doll in particular, um, she has actual removable shoes. She must be the uh, only doll, Mattel doll, that has removable shoes. And this is her shoe. I actually have um, three of the shoes. There's supposed to be a set of two shoes. So four shoes in all, but I only have three. So I'm missing one shoe, and here's her other shoe. As you can see, that's like her little itty bitty shoe. I don't put these shoes on her that much, except when I'm going to display her. <laughs> Otherwise, I'll keep her shoes in um, a little plastic baggie, little Ziploc baggie, and I put it with the rest of my uh, miniature clothes. And um, the, the nice thing about her is that even though she's short, she does fit into Glamour Gal or Dazzle Doll or other miniature size doll, uh, size, uh, doll clothes. So um, she's not just limited to just wearing this outfit. But I'm showing you what she looks like with this outfit. Currently online on eBay, they're selling this doll for like $145.00 in mint package with um, eight dollars for the shipping uh, so you can tell that this doll is worth a lot I've also seen this doll for about three hundred dollars on another website 
So getting at 145 is really a bargain because I've seen this doll marked really expensive. I've also seen her one other time on eBay and um, it was one of the brunettes who had missing hair, her paint was coming off, her clothes was practically tattered and because the eBay user put a very detailed description of what the doll was and who it was um, the seller was able to get $45 for her even in a very bad condition that she was so uh, I got her for 35 which is a deal because I mean she has perfect hair her makeup is intact her clothes is just perfect really and she has the accessories so I got her like ten dollars less than what this other um, eBay buyer had bought um, her doll for so yeah I just wanted to show you another type of doll that I have and she's the rarest doll I have ever seen and I've never actually seen a video made about this type of doll so I decided I would post it that way you can see that Mattel used to make miniature dolls and there's her shoe thank you for watching bye